okay. Hi, so this is Camille. Today's day 12 of hyperbaric oxygen therapy. It is only fitting that when you talk about how your insomnia has gotten better, that you have insomnia that night. <laughs> um, so, you know, compared to what it used to be, because when I struggled with insomnia in the past, what would happen is that my muscles were, um, were really, like I was, it was almost like a fight or flight when I'd be trying to sleep with insomnia in the past. So like my muscles were really tight. Um, but I noticed like last night when I was struggling with insomnia that my muscles were much more relaxed. So that is a huge improvement. Um, I think what woke me up is it felt like, and it didn't, it was concerning to me, but it just like, I noticed some nerve pain, um, or something. Um, I don't know. It was just like, it was interesting because I'm like, okay, well, the, it's not the muscles that are the issue. Um, there's some sort of issue with the nerves or something. Um, and I felt it in my uh, left thigh. So, um, that's just kind of where we're at. I'm going to get ready. Um, I'm going to get ready to head off to my appointment. So I'll see you all then. video I'm actually self-administering the hyperbaric oxygen therapy treatment this isn't usual like usually somebody administers the treatment for you um, part of it is that I'm a part of the case study and then also I'm just interested in hyperbaric oxygen therapy some people might not be able to administer it themselves so um, I just kind of wanted to kind of give that caveat um, just so people have the heads up about that um, the other thing I wanted to talk about was that, um, I had a little bit of a time issue today. Like I kind of lost track of time, um, because it's supposed to be the 20 minutes on, five off, 20 on, five off, 20 on, um, when it comes to receiving oxygen. And, you know, I, I kind of lost track of time. So, you know, that's kind of a part of having ADHD is that time can be an issue. Um, but on the most part, I've done pretty well with timing in that, but just something I'm going to work on.
So as I talked about earlier, I struggled with insomnia last night. Um, and I was surprised about how much better I felt after doing the treatment, after struggling with insomnia the night before. So I just feel a lot better. Um, in general, I have more energy. I feel a little bit more clear because I did not, <laughs> it was probably pretty obvious, but I did not feel good this morning. So um, yeah, so that was another thing I've noticed today. And I just want to say thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. All right, bye.